Well, here we have what's called a flocculator, and most flocculators consist of three distinct basins that are separated by baffles. And each flocculation chamber has a different mixing energy. And as you can see, in the stage one flocculation chamber, you have high mixing energy, where the particles are moving around very quickly. In the second stage, the particles have gotten bigger because they've flocked together or agglomerated, and the mixing energy gets lessened, so we have medium mixing energy. And the purpose of that is so we don't break the flock apart. And then finally, in the third chamber, we have low mixing energy, and that low mixing energy uh, allows the flock to continue to get bigger and form a flock that will be able to settle in the sedimentation basin. And as the flock gets bigger, we want the mixing energy to be less and less so that the flock does not come apart. So notice here in this third stage chamber, we've seen the particles even get bigger as they attach with one another. This flock is now ready to settle in the sedimentation basin.